Hello everyone, hello, Sessa right here with more Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. Um, like I was just saying to the stream, we need to go over here because there is something I forgot. That's right, I got a cool sword, that's what I got. No, um... Oh, alright, sweet. Anyway, what we're going over here for is pretty simple. Done. Alright, let's hop into the water. So you remember that wishing waterfall we went to? It's like over here somewhere. Actually, where was that? Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. It's up there. Okay, we gotta... If I remember correctly, there is something else I could have gotten. You son of a bitch. Oh shit. I didn't mean to fire my arrows. Oops. You know, grass doesn't really give you many arrows in this. Anyway. My uh, brother mentioned this to me because he was looking at my VOD and uh, like I said, normally I don't want people telling me that I miss things because if I miss them, I miss them, life goes on. Serious problem, once you throw something in, throw it in. No shit, I didn't want to throw that in. Fuck! Popped up too quick. That's how you tried to almost never use arrows, yeah. I, I like never use arrows. Well, oh, that's not true. Fluffy! Hello, you're here early today! How's your summer going, my friend? I am excellent. I was a little sleepy, but I'm starting to wake up now. Oh no, okay. I like an honest person. I will give you something better in return. Yeah, I completely forgot about this. Your shield is improved. You can now defend yourself against fireballs. There we go. Yeah, my uh, my brother was like, yeah, you can get this shield. I'm like, shit, you can? Fuck, I forgot all about that. There you go. So, yeah, there we go. You absolute fuck. This is a quick access back. It's like running from Pallet to, uh, back to Pallet Town from Radiant City. You played games all day? What games were you playing? What amazing activities did you get up to, Fluffy? We all know that you are one of the best gamers out there. Alright. So. I know yesterday we did, uh, we already got to the top of the mountain, so we're gonna be retreading some, uh, some pathways here, but... League of Legends and Dead by Daylight, you're pretty shit to be honest. I don't know about that, you can't be any worse than the majority of gamers out there. Like, I am pretty bad at games, so I guarantee if we were to play League together, you would destroy me. Now, unfortunately, that is not an invitation to play League with me because I'm not, probably not going to install that game. That said, I think Silly plays League. Oh, this guy's ignoring me. Kenzie Blaine, hello! Long time no see! I haven't seen you since near, I think. 
You missed all of Nino Kuni. Nino Kuni was so good. No, really, I actually really enjoyed Nino Kuni. Yeah, that. What are you going over here for? A fucking walking. Been busy? That's okay. What, uh, what, what you been up to? Late for about three years? You're a regular veteran now. Shit, I don't know if I'll that. That's what that old man was. So there's a heart in that pot. Listen to that music though. Looking play for a job plus playing Berseria. Oh, well I can't uh, fault you for playing Berseria. That game ended up being fucking amazing. I absolutely enjoyed Tales of Berseria. It might just be the placebo effect since people seem to really hate Sisteria. I didn't actually hate Sisteria, but um, I could tell it wasn't as good as a lot of the other Tales games. Like, they were just testing stuff, it seemed like. Oh, we got hit by one rock. That's not too terrible. And Mario Kart! Black Tripe loves Mario Kart. The question is, Fluffy, did you win, and was it with a blue shell? I, Sahasrala, the other. I have some advice. In the dungeons, you can gaze into the magic mirror to return to the entrance at any time. Do not forget this. So the end boss of this dungeon is probably one of the most annoying bosses I've ever fought. Yeah, hit by three blue shells? Oh man, that's the worst. The map already, that was quick. Let's go down first. Well, uh, see that, how that uh, skeleton had a red skull? The difference between them and this, uh... That's it? I thought there'd be more to that. Alright. Anyway, the difference between them and the normal uh, skull, uh, the blue skeletons is that when they jump, they uh, throw a bone as well. But I was hitting too quickly to make that, for that to matter. Dick. Surprised at how popular No Man's Sky is? That's true, it is really popular. I'm being really bad today, sorry. It'll, it'll take me a moment here to wake up. I'm still mostly asleep. 
that not good at this game. That does two things. All right, how long are you trying? Okay, I'm gonna get There's a master key. Yeah, yeah, you're right. The, with the updates that they did to it, it's definitely a lot more like what they advertised. People seem to be a lot more happy with it, which is good. And Silly's, I know Silly was super excited to play it back when it came out, and was kind of, kind of upset that they didn't go the route that he wanted. Shit. I'm gonna hand off the controller too. Wow, what the fuck am I doing? I'm like the worst. I'm losing all my health. Hello! There, we got the compass. Look at that. We're on floor four. Sass, it is I, Sassuala the Elder. An orb known as the Moon Pearl is in this tower. Whoever holds the Moon Pearl is protected so that his form will not change in the Dark World. You must find it and escape from the tower. Do not forget the Moon Pearl. Excellent. How are you doing, Pete the Magic D? We got Fluffy in chat. We got Silly. We're talking about No Man's Sky. Kenzie Blaine's here. Ow. Dicks.
Oh, they do die. Alright, I wasn't sure about that. Okay, that's not quite where I thought I was going to land, but alright. I actually got some decent sleep. Yeah. Okay, we got two fairies here. Well, let's catch one and use the other. Sure. Keep forgetting, I don't need the bottle to catch them. You actually got some decent sleep, I'm happy to hear that. What have you been up to otherwise? What's your day been that? Look at this fucking Mario fireball spinning thing. You found the moon pearl! It protects the hero from the changing effects of the golden power. Alright, so now we gotta go actually fight the end boss of the dungeon. Um, this end boss is probably... This end boss was probably the uh, most annoying boss I've fought in, in a game in a long time. I'm hoping I can have an easier time with them here. We'll see. So this guy... He moves around the platform. He's fucking annoying. He'll knock you off. Like that! Fuck! And depending where you get knocked off, you can fall all the way down to the bottom. Son of a bitch! What? Now they spawn. Shit. Well, that's not great. But it also means the fairies will probably respawn as well. I guess the most annoying part about this is that I gotta run all the way back up. So this could take me a while, as I'm not great at this part. So much. Okay, trying again. I don't know if he actually slows down or if he stays at the same health. Oh, no. like one or two more. Okay, good. I'd rather actually rather that than uh, getting knocked flying off. Bots is still knocking flying off. Oh, this boss is the worst. No! If I remember correctly, that's probably the most annoying boss in the game. You won the Pendant of Wisdom with this. You have collected all three pendants. Go now to the Lost Woods to get the Master Sword. Yeah, I think it does reset every time. Fuck 
asking a little Tanuki. I think that's what that's supposed to be. Yeah. Alright, I need to find a fairy fountain real quick so that I can uh, replenish my fairy supply before I go on to the next little bit. Anyway, that went surprisingly faster than I thought it was going to. I normally have a lot of trouble with that thing. Oh shit, I can't get out this way. Fuck, how do I get off Death Mountain? Wait, I remember. Uh... Let's not do this, kid. It's one of the other caves that I explored. So, P, I actually made it uh, further in Digimon Cyber Sleuth, uh, Hacker's Memory last night. And, uh, yeah, I, uh... The game is longer than I thought. We'll, we'll leave it at that. Much larger than I thought. Shit, this is that old man's house. Well, fuck. How the hell do I get out of this place? Is it the other cave to the far left? I think that might be it. Okay, hang on. <laughs> My knowledge of Death Mountain is extremely limited, it seems. But yes, it needs to be reset every time I fell. That said, Susanomon um, is actually a lot better than I gave it credit for because uh, they started introducing enemies that have resistance to defense piercing attacks. So my Armageddon Mon and my uh, Susanomon are getting uh, more use. And my uh, Apocalypse Mon, of course. Alright! Now, where the hell was a fairy town? Oh. I know where a great fairy town is. need to catch two fairies. There might be one over here. I don't remember if this is a great fairy fountain or just a fairy fountain with like the fairies I can catch. We will find out. Either way I need two of them. Damn it's this kind of fairy. Alright. Something I want. Something I want at all. one down here, somewhere. That soldier's just like, fuck him, I got out of there. Uh, look at this, I seem to have committed every great fairy fountain to memory, but not every fountain that has the little ones. You know what? I think. Who's the most OP member of my team? 
probably... I mean, it depends on the situation, right? If it's a non, uh... If it's an enemy that's resistant to defense piercing attacks, probably Armageddonmon. Uh, if it's weak to electricity, then definitely Sasanomon is OP. He, uh, he'll just destroy anything that... I it was in here. Sword by Katero! Hello, Katero! Long time no see. But yeah, it's uh, definitely Sasanomon. I see you, hard piece. I think there's only like one more heart piece I can get at this point. I'm pretty sure it's in the Lost Woods. Almost 100% right next one. Sure. Big trouble. I don't want big trouble. But anyway, we're here for this. I didn't do this yesterday because I figured I, I I didn't need these fairies. Got him. Did you ever play? Of course I played Lake Between Worlds. I was super excited when that game came out. How about you, Katara? Did you play Link Between Worlds? I haven't fought this on a month. Shit, I wanted to get more arrows. Okay, give me a sec. You felt like you were gonna beat it, so you stopped. Phrasing there, maybe? I don't want big trouble. Want to carry my arrows? There you go. Man, lady, I've spent so many rupees on your on your damn fountain. You better be able to increase my arrow capacity. You gotta increase it to a thousand. Imagine that being able to carry 999 arrows. All right, let's head over to the lost ones now, guys. Right? What does she need rupees for? Thanks the question. Same question as to, uh, what does God need your money for? When, when churchgoers are like, can you spare some alms and some money for God? What does God need my money for? You'd figure she'd be able to make rupees with magic, right? I'm glad I'm not the only one who, who, who thinks that. Like, I get the church wants to, wants it to upgrade the church, but, you know, they, they, they say, for God. Shit, why am I going that way? It's actually faster to go up this way. Look at that guy, just hiding in the grass. Oh shit, those guys. Ah! A red soldier! This blue soldier had my number. Okay, I thought it was faster, but apparently I'm on the other side of the river. That's not great. I don't think I've ever been on this side of the map. A fairy jacuzzi or something, or, the, or some gems. Well, if the uh, fairies in uh, Breath of the Wild are anything to go by, and they're at all related to these fairies, I don't think they build a gem. The gods need love too, and the only way they can get it is with money. What are they, Tiamat? I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna go up this way. We're heading into the Lost Woods. I'm not uh, shaming the fairies, by the way. If that was the life choice they wanted to make and they're happy, then more power to them. But still, I don't think a gym is what they went for. Oh, Those bad about the wild fairies are thick, yo. It's true. Listen, lost, lost forest. Get wrecked. Who the fuck do you think you are? Aha. Look at all that eyeshadow. They have a ton of makeup. 
Damn it! I'm one piece of heart away from another heart. They look like hooker clowns? I don't know about that. Hey kid, this is a secret hideout for a gang of thieves. Don't enter without permission. By the way, I heard that one of our ex-members is staying at the entrance to the desert. Huh, it's that guy. They look like... It's true, that would explain their need for money. Hello. This is it! The Master Sword! No, this can't be it. Too bad. Who the hell just goes around making a whole bunch of replica swords and sticking them around the forest? That's kind of rude. Oh, player game, get out of here. Who's the pimp for the fairies, you wonder? He likes pimp out poor Link. Oh, there's a mushroom. I want that. The mushroom smells sweet, like rot uh, like sweet rotten fruit. You can give this to anyone who wants it. Oh, okay, cool. I actually know who wants that. Remember that old woman that in front of the uh, magic shop? She said she wanted a rotting uh, fruit mushroom. Well, not really a rotting fruit mushroom, but a mushroom in general. Look at that fake sword. Oh man, look at this grove. Look at the bunnies and the birds and the squirrels. Hmm. This looks promising. And there we have it! Suddenly, Sahasrala contacts you telepathically. Sass, it is extraordinary that you won the Master Sword that makes evil retreat. With this shining sword, I believe you can deflect the wizards with evil powers. The destiny of this land is in your hands. Please, Sass. Yeah, it's in my hands, not yours, mine. Hey, why are you guys running across the forest again? Kakariko to Village is your favorite town in Breath of the Wild? Sass, help! The soldiers are coming to the sanctuary! Ah, one hit! One hit, why, why did pulling out the Master Sword clear out the fog? That's not how fog works. I'm pretty sure that's not how fog works. I mean, maybe the Master Sword was also a fog machine. And when I pulled it out of the pedestal, it was like, alright, I can stop emitting fog now. But you took the sword off the power button. Good music, pretty fun to explore. Link's uncle proved that in this. Yeah, it's true. Link is their only John because he is the one that won't die if he loses the vote. It's true. Link's uncle did die. P, how do you feel about Link's uncle? Kato, did you like uh, a Link to, uh, a Link to the Past? Oh, this guy. Sass, you are a second too late. I have failed. Zelda, the soldiers have abducted her. They've taken her to the castle. You must find her before the magic wizard works his magic. Please, you are our only hope. Don't remember if you did it. This game's pretty awesome. Uh, I know Trank really likes this game. I uh, really like the game. Um, I'm looking forward to getting to some of the Zelda games that I haven't played before, but uh, for now... Well, actually, that's not true. I've already beaten a Zelda game that I've never played before. Let's kill this guy so he can give me a heart. Two hits. Man, you guys... Actually, that's impressive. That guy survived two hits with the Master Sword. Anyway, um... I, I beat Zelda 2 on stream Kataro, and I almost had an aneurysm. That game was fucking hard. Majora's Mask is one that you remember very well. Majora's Mask is one of my favorites, and I like to think I remember it pretty well, but uh, Majora's Mask is probably my second favorite Zelda game. But uh, yeah, Zelda 2 is super hard, and I almost got an aneurysm playing it. 
Oh, look at that! I hate that fucking sound, but... Yeah, I beat Zelda 2! That game was fucking obnoxious! And I am not ashamed to say that I used save states to do it, but, uh, I tried to use them as little as possible. Mmm, the snail of rotten fruit! If you give me that mushroom, I can finish my brew! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Thank you, young man. Come back to the shop later for something good. <laughs> Why is his hair pink? Um, I don't think they intended to make it pink. It was just something that happened when they uh, developed the game. Uh, and they're like, fuck it, just leave it. Oh, okay. It literally means come back later. Yeah. Um, I don't think the, the intention was for it to be pink. Have a giant rock. Also, Star Fox, hello! I do not... You know what? There's no shame in not being able to beat uh, Zelda 2. When I looked up uh, the guide for it after I beat the game, I, uh... I, I was reading all these comments on it, and these people were like, 25 years later, and I finally beat the game. <laughs> so... You thought your uncle's, uh, the uncle's meant to be blue? Yeah, you're probably right. <laughs> yeah, there's absolutely no shame in not being able to beat that game. And it wasn't even just a single post. Yeah, it, it's been out for 25 years. Ah, uh, I think it's been out for almost 30 now. I think 30 in 2019. So I can't go in there. If I step under that archway, it actually takes me to the dark world. So what you want to do is go back up here through this area. That game is older than me. Alright, hang on a sec guys, I'm going to reset our recording here.